As a young girl, I dreamed of a huge taboo as the ideal 18th birthday party, with a magnificent location, a long list of invited guests, etc. But as I got closer to the age of 18, I realized that the celebration with my loved ones, my family, is where my heart truly belongs. So, I'm going to tell you about my family's vacation to Singapore that we had for my 18th birthday. Welcome to the first episode of My Singapore Vlog. On August 24, 2023, we left the house at 5 p.m. to catch our night flight. Here's my dad attempting to inflate our neck pillow. Since our flight was around 10 p.m., we had to eat late dinner on the airplane. We had Hainanese chicken rice for dinner, which was so good. Welcome to Singapore. The local time is 1.45 on Friday the morning, 25th of August, and the temperature is 29 degrees Celsius. Touchdown, Singapore. I already anticipated an airport of a different level, but I was still amazed by how clean their airport is. It's currently 2 a.m. and I got to sleep with it. Upon arrival, we claimed our transportation cards and our baggage. On our way to our hotel, our driver rolled down the window on my side of the seat to show us Singapore at night. And he even shared that they were already preparing for the F1 race that was set to happen three weeks after our visit. It was already 1 a.m. when we arrived, so we were all tired, but our funny driver kept us awake. Chicken chop, huh? <laughs> but providing me chicken nuggets is chop in half, right? So if you ask me to do this, I would rather just make the sauce myself mm. and I just cook it at home. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Twice the size. <laughs> Not chopped. <laughs> no, sorry, brother. This is the chicken chop. Eh, shut up, shut up. Salad with the mango and the biscuit. Graham? Is it Graham? Yeah, mango Graham. Mango Graham. With the white color creamy thingy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, Lucky Cafe sells, because uh, I'm a Muslim, right? Uh, so, they sell halal oh. Filipino food. Mm. <laughs> wow. Yeah. wow! So the tapsi log. Okay, what why I like about tapsi log right? Because after eating that with uh, chili, right? The next day, the toilet will be my best friend. <laughs> it's like detoxing, you know. <laughs> Good morning! Today is our first official day in Singapore. We have a lot of activities for today, but first, we took the bus to go to our first stop of the day, which is the very place that made me want to go to Singapore.
We entered the shops at Marina Bay on our way to the Art Science Museum. My dad took many pictures of the mall because of how pretty it was. It rained a bit on our way here but that didn't stop us from admiring the pretty lotus flowers just outside the Art Science Museum and the beautiful buildings in the background. Let me transport you to a moment of pure joy. As I've mentioned before, this place is the reason why I chose Singapore for my 18th birthday. I was mesmerized the moment I entered the room because dancing displays of butterflies and flowers greeted me. A fun fact about me is that I love butterflies, so to be one with them in this room really made me happy. On to the next room, which had lots of interactive activities that let me get in touch with my inner child. First, I tried this kitty slide. <laughs> After that, my mom and I tried this interactive drawing station where you can get a template of a sea creature and customize it. When scanned, you will see it interact with the other sea creatures that other people drew. My mom chose a sea turtle template, beautifully colored it, and even included our dog, Zoe. The next room had this interesting step thingy that glowed. I was really hesitant to try it out because it seemed unstable and scary to be on, but we only live once, so I decided to try it out. If you're planning on going here, I suggest wearing closed shoes because some attractions here in Singapore only allow people with closed shoes. The room that I have been waiting for. The very place that made me want to go to Singapore. Its beauty is self-explanatory, but I felt like I was in an enchanting dream.
been swept. Closing time. Time for lunch? After Art Size Museum, we return to the shops at Marina Bay to eat lunch. What's this? This is salmon carbonara and then what's that? Taksa. And then what's that? Yay! First official Singaporean meal. We had our first official Singapore meal here. You better be where the rumor is out. Nothing can stop me from going for cold. I'm out of the dark. I'm out of the cold. Tomorrow's getting closer. Yesterday has gone. We're trying to figure out how to go to Gardens by the Bay since this right here is closed and we have to go there. But look at that! It rained again on our way to Gardens by the Bay. That rhymed. But anyway, like before, we still enjoyed walking because of the beautiful buildings surrounding us. <laughs> this is your happy place. <laughs> From the little prince, the baobabs. Wow, look at that. It's muy bonita. Look at that. <laughs> it's scary. It's scary. Oh, it's zombie. <laughs> we are now at Flower Dome, my mom's favorite place. My mom loves gardening, so seeing different kinds of flowers and plants <laughs> made her happy. To be honest, Flower Dome was a bit overwhelming, but in a good way because of the many beautiful flowers and plants. Happy it's cold. Hi, Nathops! I'm not lucky! Wow! Wow! Because of this, my sister and I would constantly say, Wow! I also enjoy this place because it was cold and the commute going there was the opposite. Oh, Ate, it's us! It's me and you! Okay. You're a horse! <laughs> all of our activities were booked using Cluck, so if you're interested in booking through Cluck as well, all the links are in my description box as usual. It looks like macaroni and cheese. I want to eat it. Delicious. 
Double perfume oil lip gloss. Okay, I want. Me too. Mom, I. <laughs> this one's yeah, nice. This is pretty. I got roll on perfume oil. I like this for my. Roll on glitter. We're going to Shake Shack. We are now done in Flower Dome and we're at Shake Shack for a quick rest because our feet hurt. We decided to stop by Shake Shack, which was just walking distance from Flower Dome, to buy cold drinks. However, we realized that we didn't have time before our next stop to eat dinner, so we just had early dinner in Shake Shack. We are now on the way to the famous towering super trees in Gardens by the Bay. That's not where we're going. We're just going to go on the very top. This is how it looks like right now without the lights open. We first went to the Super Grove Observatory to look at Singapore from above, which I must admit was a very scary experience. I couldn't film as much because every time I tried to bring my phone out, I'd already overthink that I'd drop my phone. Regardless, it was a nice experience to see Singapore from such a high point. So, so we were there a while ago, and then this is what you can see. And I, if it doesn't look scary from here, and I'm, I'm pretty used to heights, it's just that. For the last activity of the day, we are now looking for a spot to watch the light show. I recommend securing a spot a couple of minutes before the show itself so that you can choose a spot where most of the super trees are seen. What we have right now. There are a lot of people sitting. The moment the light show started, I felt goosebumps because of the anticipation and the beautiful parade of lights. The music chosen and the arrangement of lights that made the super trees come to life made the show enjoyable for me. In celebration of Singapore's birthday, we present Songs of Singapore. So spot, grab your cameras, and enjoy the show. I am 
craving for a water brand that I know. And I want Coke. I hope they have a Coke. For the next episode of my Singapore vlog, I will be sharing my first time in Universal Studios. Thank you for watching and see you on my next one.